Good morning, folks. I'd like to thank J7409 for sharing this article with us yesterday. We'll put it below in case you're interested. If you happen across this uh, blog on the internet, which happens to be the top thing when you search suspicious observers, it has nothing to do with me whatsoever. You might know that violence is being perpetrated against Christians all over the world, and Egypt is one of the worst places that's happening. They just lost their leader. So we have a look at the RSOE. We had a very serious earthquake swarm in the Indian Ocean with fours and five magnitude earthquakes. We also had two very interesting interesting earthquakes over in the Pacific Ridge west of Chile. These are pretty large for this area, although we do see them there occasionally. Coming over and looking at Japan, about 600 kilometers to the east, we have radioactive plankton. I've said it before, folks, this is the single worst disaster in the history of humanity. There was a landslide last night in China as we come one more time over to the western part of the world. The earthquake swarm in the Virgin Islands and Puerto Rico region is right on time and getting stronger by the week. So we have a look at some of these solar active regions, folks. Solar activity was low. It's because the active regions up north, the ones that were complex, were pretty much uh, disintegrating and falling apart. But about an hour after the two-minute news yesterday, that region in the south began to do this, get darker, grow, morph around, and become magnetically complex. And about an hour after that, it put off an M-flare. Now here's a quick, uh, quick word. When you don't see something that you're expect to seeing on there, jump over to the one-minute uh, x-ray link down below and it'll give you a better shot of that but this is it coming out of this active region right here now most of these satellites are saturated with a much larger eruption that happened on the back side of the planet so you can't really see the ejected material on just about any of the satellite images but watch the ripple effect just above it that is the ejected material flying around a little bit you can see it a little on the stereo a definitely not even worth putting on here uh, but this really wasn't a big coronal mass ejection. All it does show is that these active regions can come out of nowhere and fire off a flare when you least expect it. That's the news, folks. These active regions are turning a limb, but we'll have to keep an eye on all of this. Be safe.